Likely opinion with your host, Frank Chambers. Any Chambers. I'd like to apologize for that disgusting comment that was made earlier. And I want you to feel safe in knowing that that writer is no longer with the Nightly Opinion staff. Just wanted to get that out of the way. Thank you. Is he fucking serious? Now with all these young girls in the audience in the front row been hollering about, hi mom, we want to welcome back my brother Eddie Chambers. Come on out here, Eddie. Eddie. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You know, I knew we were going to get to that question tonight. Okay. I mean, with all the rumors flying around about drug problems and anger issues and more drug problems, I thought this would be as good as a place as any to address it. Okay. I'm not angry anymore. <laughs> kidding, kidding, kidding. I was clean as a whistle and just glad to be back. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. Welcome back. Welcome back, brother. Who's the uh, guest for tonight? Well, tonight we have the barrier-breaking senator from Oregon, Eugene Tallis, and also with her, with him, the author of the new book, Woman, Five Letters Fit to Raise a Child, the head of the WFBC, Ms. Audrey Schilling. Come on out. Come on out, Senator Ms. Schilling. Thanks for joining us. Doing good. Tomorrow we're going to teach in paper or plastic. Um, why we have you two here tonight is because uh, Senator and Ms. Schilling. Ms. Schilling, may I call you Audrey? No, no, you can't. Maybe. Anyway, the reason we brought you on the show tonight is because, Senator, you're introducing a controversial new bill on abortion, and Ms. Schilling here and her organization are blatantly against it. That's right, Frank. I prefer Mr. Chambers. Yeah. Hey, Senator, tell us about this bill. Well, it's really simple, Frank. What I propose is that the doctor-patient agreement be signed by both the mother and father-to-be. To be, not to be. Precisely. And that's where you've gone completely off the map, Senator. Now, Ms. Schilling, in your book, Chapters O through A, you argue specifically against the Senator and his bill. Now, granted, I only read the first and last chapters, but as the head representative of the WFBC... Mr. Chambers... It's WFFBC. That's the third time you made that mistake tonight. Well, I'm sorry. You know, uh, if it's all the same, and I think it is, oh, it is. I'd rather leave the first F out. <laughs> Mr. Chambers, when the WFFBC was created in 1978, our founding mothers and daughters worked day okay, and night okay, to... Okay. okay, now, okay, stop it. Please, please, folks. You know I love you all out there now, but, you know, I taught you better than that. Now, why don't we just apologize to Ms. Schilling and give her a chance to defend herself? Let's hear it now. Okay. Ms. Schilling, I'm sorry, too. Thank you. I appreciate the gesture. You know, Ms. Schilling, frankly, I'm with you on this one. I think it was Mother Teresa who said, any country that doesn't accept abortion is not teaching its people to love but to, to use, use any, any violence, violence to, to get, get what, what it wants. wants. <laughs> Call me Audrey. Perhaps we could uh, continue talking about that F word after the show. Fantastic. <laughs> and maybe I'll tell you more about my next book. Right. Five more letters picked to raise a child. I like it. You know, Eddie has five letters in it, too. But out. You know, it's really been a great show tonight. Two very interesting guests, a little hand-to-hand -hand combat, and a possible romantic evening. Hey, Eddie, why don't you get the senator's number? Maybe we could double. <laughs> I prefer all their men. Well, anyway, I know it seems like a full show tonight, but the fun isn't over yet. In honor of my brother Eddie's return, we have a little surprise for you, Eddie. Reprising her star role in the hit movie, Play Golda for me. A show favorite, Miss Chrissy Anderson. What's there for? Hello. Right. I can't believe Hello. I'm back here. I don't think Eddie can either. Great to see you both. You know, you look more beautiful every time you're on the show. 
So you think it's the show? Oh, definitely. You are such a flirt, stop Frank. Stop it, stop Don't it. Don't play innocent. Come on. You must be so glad to have your brother back. Who? Oh, yeah, Eddie. <laughs> Can I just so. say something? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Those pants are amazing. What? What? Those These pants, open? where did you get them? Ah, come on. There's nothing special. Go on out there and show the audience. No, no. Go on out no. there. Oh, okay, on. okay. Oh, <laughs> All right. So embarrassed. You look great. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Thank you. You know what? We do have a subtle elegance here. Oh!